rather than displaying the register contents in a split, we can also do it in a floating window. There is a useful plugin called float.mvim, which makes the API a lot simpler. All you need to do is create the float object and give the height and the width. You can either specify it with an integer or floating number. So passing integer 3 makes the height of 3 lines 0 0.8 will make it 80% of the window. We can place the window at the center. We should also name the float to register. And open it as scratch buffer. Don't forget to open the floating window by calling the function open. To write to the float, we can call a write function with the line number with the list of strings. Let's put some strings into register A and register B. So now pressing Ctrl R will open the float with the contents of register A and register B. Since there is one more extra line, we can also include register C. Now it looks much better. If you want the window to be at the bottom of the screen, we can call align to bottom after centering the floating window. So now, just like before, pressing A, paste the content of register A, pressing B, the register B, and pressing C, register C.